Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Assalamu alaikum. Salam Khan here. And today uh, we just a little minor sort of a topic that is the difference between a latch and flip flop. Difference uh, between latch and flip flop. Okay. Now uh, we have studied the SR latch previously. The flip flops we have not studied yet, but you have seen me using the word these words simultaneously for the memory element. I always say this could either be a flip flop or it could be a uh, could be a what? Could be a latch. The similarity is that both are used for binary storage. Both are used for what? For storage, for storing a single bit, all right? Both are used for storing a single bit. So this is the similarity that they are storage devices. But what are the differences? So we have just one big difference and we'll come to that in the end, all right? Before that, I need to, to, to show you something. So we come a little in a wronger way. So, I believe till here you have seen this circuit before. Yes, you had one input over here and one input over here. All right, these were the outputs Q and Q complement. Let's say I introduce another, another NOT gate, uh, NAND gate over here and one NAND gate over here. Now the inputs that used to be over here are is over here and S that used to be over here is over here. So let's say I name this as an S star and this as an R star. Sorry, uh, this is an R star and over here we have S star. And one common input is given and what is this common input? So I will tell you now. Now previously we didn't have this common input which basically is the enable signal. Which basically is the control signal I could say. So I represent it by a C. Now this is a control signal. Previously we didn't have it. We had this thing directly. Directly one input, directly the other input. Now to store that information, we need to retain the, the inputs as well. To store it, uh, S and R should be high in this case, I believe. Yes, and low in the, in the NOR SR latch. Now this circuit that you are seeing is an SR flip-flop, which in the next video we are covering in a great detail, but here is just for introduction. Now you need to store Q and Q complement so if your S changes or your R changes intentionally or accidentally, the output changes. We can have multiple inputs and by mistake, by mistake, the output can change. Now to avoid that accident or that intention even to change it through an S and R, we introduce another control signal which now, which now has the control to change the output Q and Q complement. All right. So this does what this clock signal is basically is the control signal uh, that decides when to change S and R in the latch in order to store Q and Q complement. All right. Now this circuit, this circuit can act both as flip-flop and latch, both as flip-flop and latch. Now how is that? So we see it now, okay? Now if this control signal, this control signal is an enable signal, if this is an E, if this, is, if this is an enable signal, if the control is just a simple enable signal, this circuit is working as a latch. 
the circuit is working as a latch and what is a latch so this latch is a uh, level triggered all right this latch is level triggered which means that the circuit will operate when enable is equal to one when the enable is high which means if i have a random sort of a signal let's say like this with some other duty cycle than the clock that has 50 percent now this circuit will be working for whenever this this condition comes that the value of the function a value of the enable signal is high all right and when would it actually be as, as a clock when this control signal if this control signal is equal to the clock signal so now this circuit the drone circuit will work will work as a flip flop and what is a flip flop so this is now an edge triggered device what is a flip flop now this will work on edge triggering this is edge trigger which means whenever the clock is going from high to low or it could also be that the clock is coming from low to high all right so then it will be working as a clock and as a, as a flip-flop and this as our flip-flop particularly we see in the very next video in a great detail so let us talk about this point over here like a little when the enable is high okay now when the enable is high let's say first we have s complements value the sorry s stars value so the value of s star is what it is uh, s into enable and then a whole complement which means it is s complement or with the enable complement now enable is one so the enables complement would be zero and now in this case we have this s star is equal to s complement and similarly if you have for r star so r star is r into e whole complement the NAND operation and from the de morgan's law you have r complement or with the enable complement and which implies over here again that r complement r star would be equal to r complement similarly now if you have for the enable signal is equal to zero if the enable signal is zero so what do you have from there s star is equal to one s star is equal to one and r star is equal to one which is now acting as a as a what as a memory as the sr latch and this is the condition for memory and how did this come so we have s star as s complement plus the enable complement now s complement could either be zero or one but the enable complement is one this enable complement uh, is one and we know that a or with one is again one so this is how we get s star equal to one and r star equal to one and it acts as a memory now to sum this thing up the whole presentation or the whole video was just for this point that your latch is basically level triggered or level sensitive and your flip flop is edge triggered or it is edge sensitive so the the basic point behind all of this i took the time i told you i will tell you in the end the video the, the the difference between the latch and flip-flop this is all the difference that was all just to know something about it and that's all about today see in the next lecture very soon inshallah we'll be start about the topic of uh flip-flops and the first flip-flop that we see is the sr flip-flop so see you there very soon inshallah till then take care goodbye